Get up, stretch my legs. Brush my teeth up, wash my face. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Start my day. Wake up, get up, get up, stretch my legs. Eat some breakfast, milk and eggs. Brush my teeth up, wash my face. Throw my clothes on, start my day. Wake up, I can smell the smoke from the bacon. Yeah, I'm gonna have those a little bit more now in the mornings. I had, I had one in the morning yesterday, and I'm gonna have one this morning now. And yeah, it's kind of set, kind of sets me up a little bit for the day, knowing that I've had like a thousand calories to start the day. I used to do it before, like three years ago, have one every single day, but like in the mornings. But I started to have them in the evenings just because I found that eating food was to me was more important than getting liquid calories in. But this is just a bit more convenient for the mornings. But yeah, anyway, welcome to another video. I'm now 27. It was a quality birthday. I, I went to this, um, we went to this place called Laneley Hall. And um, yeah, it was phenomenal. What a place. I felt so out of place as well, just because I was wearing like, I, I wore like a, um, like a like a Nike crew neck down to breakfast and it was like really, really posh. And yeah, it was crazy. And um, yeah, the pool was amazing. Just, yeah, I got well and truly spoiled. So yeah, it was such a good birthday. But I just wanted to start the video off by showing you um, the setup. Well, actually, a present that I got actually for my birthday off Rima, which I was it just like is really cool. I'm gonna get like a, a shelf to put it on, but this is it. So this is the desk setup at the moment. Just zoom out a little bit, hi Frank. So yeah, so I've changed it to I've changed the um, the lights to red just for this for this bit, but I've added a um, a, la a, a lamp like a clamped lamp to go on there, just a bit more light. And then this, Tommy Wells lights up. So that's actually red. I don't know if it's, it comes across as red in the in the video, but yeah, that's uh, that's red. And I got this little storage thing by the side. It's, I think it's Hellman, Helmer? Yeah, it's Helmer from Ikea. And yeah, it just goes a lot well, a lot better with the with the whole setup. And it gives me a little bit of storage as well because, oh, I will show you Rima's side because it's a bit dirty, but Rima's got one where it's, um, actually I will show you. She's got like these two drawers and then she's got the, um, she's got the, the desk on top and it's just a bit more storage, but yeah, when I when I went for the, when I when I was putting my desk set up together, I didn't, didn't really take that into account. Yeah, that kind of hopefully resolves that problem. But um, yeah, it's getting there. I'm gonna I'm gonna probably get a um, uh, a monitor in time, but I'm gonna get a really good monitor, um, and then get a, a wireless keyboard and a trackpad to do the editing and stuff on. And then I'm gonna get a stand then for my MacBook. So I kind of got the best of both worlds then, where I can take my MacBook away and just just use my laptop wherever around the house or anywhere else. But then when I'm upstairs on, on my desk, it's as if I've got like a like a like a desktop setup. So yeah, that's that's the next purchase. Yeah, that's that. So yeah, I'm gonna go and take. I'm gonna go, actually I'm gonna have my shake first, and then I'm gonna go and take Frank for a walk and answer the first question. Right. So I forgot to take the camera out when I took Frank for a walk. So I'll just answer the first one now. Would you rather lose your beard or calves? I would rather lose my beard because it can grow back. But um, I've been wanting thinking of trimming it off for ages actually just to give my face a nice uh like fresh start so if this video gets 100 likes which i know it won't then i will shave it off Rain is awful, but um, the Six Nations is on, and every time the Six Nations is on, the gym's always dead. So yeah, I'm gonna go there now. That's literally the only reason that I look forward to the Six Nations is because the gym's always gonna be quiet on a Saturday afternoon, especially when Wales are playing at the Millennium Stadium. So yeah, it should be good. I'm gonna do some squats today, 
because I want to get better at squats. I want to get my squatting up. Um, I want to try and hit 180 um, by like the summer, which is I think is doable because it's only like what 15 kilos, but yeah, with 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 squats, I'm like on and off just because my knee and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna try and stay consistent with it. So yeah, I'm gonna do some squats today, and then just some other accessory leg work, but primarily squats. So yeah, I'll take you through it and yeah see how we get on so yeah i'll uh, see you at the gym yeah talking to my mirror like i love you so much curving all my critics like i heard you so what you can't kill my confidence i think i'm the man tally all the f i ever gave on my head And I'm coming now, my roof leaving. Don't give a f I don't care. Uh, did the for my lonesome. No wonder now I'm on one. No shortcuts on that long run. All I really want is my share. Uh, get on my god, on my told him it's nothing. In the discussion, f all them feelings I throw all my pain on percussion. The disgusting. I hear them bragging about that they did and it do not move me, not in the least. They ain't been dropping no seeds in the sub, but swear that you all my spot at the feast. I've been on go mode, show mode, showboat, robo, wave ride. Cool shot it too, naughty pool party, wet for the face ride. Any up, penny down, hand me down, thrift store, old drip. New money, too funny, old shorty talk about old. I'm on they now, can't get a pass now, I'm a cash cow, keeping it brash now. Trash now, I'm a spaz out. I've been killing my lows and living on highs. You see in the skies the proof. You could just see in my eyes that there is no lies. I cannot disguise the truth. I've been duck dog getting with my new merch, color duck sauce on the new couch with my chuck song. Get the oh, it's not probably the best leg session I've had in a while, to be honest. Like squats felt good, everything else felt good, all the accessories and stuff. Um, my glutes just feel pumped, my quads feel pumped. Yeah, it was just really enjoyable to be honest. So Put me in a good mood so um yeah i'm gonna go in now hopefully my chicken's defrosted because i'm starving see you in a bit all right so instead of having chicken i've decided to just have a big ass bowl of bran flakes with some oat milk because i'm trying to cut down on my uh, cow milk so and oat milk has just become a bit it's just become so tasty recently like just because of all this vegan stuff They've, uh, they've had a kick up the backside and actually making some decent oat milk now. So yeah, this is my um, like post-workout sort of refuel, if you, if you like. Probably have a, I'll probably have a little clear away isolate in a bit as well. But yeah, I just thought I'd, while I'm eating this, I'll probably just answer a few more questions. If you had to be sponsored by any supplement company, who would it be? Um, I'd probably say Ghost, just because I've never actually... I say that I've never actually tried ghost supplements, but I've like I've yeah more so just because I can't afford it because they're quite expensive. But I I just love their branding and just like just the flavors they've got and everyone who talks about or tr has tried ghost, they always say that it's just an amazing sort of um, protein and, and their pre workouts are mad. But I could just never afford it. Like I, I was looking at one in the gym just now. And it's a it's a ghost legend. I, the reason I, look, I was looking at it because is because I don't know whether it's a stim free or a stim. I'm gonna have to research it. Um, but I was I was looking at buying it, but it was like thirty seven quid for like uh, a, a, just a tub of pre workout with twenty five servings, and I just to me it just doesn't doesn't make sense. So, um, but if I was to be sponsored by one and obviously get these supplements for free and 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 whatever, then I would I would definitely choose Ghost, the one I'd least to get sponsored by. Um, it's probably someone like my protein or something um just because i feel like everyone's like when, once you hit like 10k on instagram or whatever you can apply to become like a my protein ambassador and get like a discount code and i feel like everyone does that so it's kind of a saturated market as it is and also i just don't really find my protein supplements that good like i know i use their clear way and, and stuff like that but like in terms of good if i wanted, if I wanted like good quality supplements i would never I would never go for my protein, um, the ones that are like a bit expensive. And also, their supplements have gotten so expensive recently. Um, I was looking, and uh, like they're like a one kilo um, bag of of just normal impact whey. It was like twenty three quid after discounts, and yeah, I, I'm I'm sure it's like 12, 13 quid. 
like before Christmas. I could be wrong, but yeah. Strength training versus hypertrophy. Which one are you choosing? Um, I would probably choose hypertrophy just because like the longevity of it, like strength training will, it'll, like injuries will crop up. So yeah, I'd probably choose hypertrophy just cause like just that feeling of having just like muscles just filled with blood and stuff is just, yeah, it, to me it just feels better than like having just aching joints and stuff from all the strength training you're doing. So yeah, I'd probably choose hypertrophy. Favorite YouTuber. Um, I feel like I've answered this before, but it it always changes because they, they they go through like peaks and troughs, don't they? YouTubers and at the moment, I'm I'm watch to be fair, I'm watching a lot of Dave trains at the moment. Like that's all I'm seeing on my um, recommended. Also, I watched one ninja video like two days ago, and all I'm getting is now is like Fortnite um, gameplay, and I've been watching a lot of that, even though I'm shit at Fortnite. But yeah, at the moment, I'm kind of watching a lot of Dave Trains. To be fair, I've been watching a lot of, um, this is this is camera, this is photographer and, and videographer, I think. Um, he's called Optical Wonder, and he does like POV, like shots of like London and stuff. And like just sitting down and watching him like just take photos and stuff. And like then, then he, he like on the screen, he puts them what they look like in like post edit. And like they just look amazing. So I've been watching a lot of that. So yeah, Dave trains for like the gym side of stuff. And then just generally, I've been watching a lot of Optical Wonder. So yeah, those are my two favorite YouTubers at the moment. But yeah, I'm gonna have this have this now because it's gone a little bit soggy because I haven't had any. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.